If you're wanting to speed up your typing on a Chromebook and you use Google Docs, then voice typing might be exactly what you're looking for. I'm gonna show you how you can do this. It's really simple to get started, but something I hadn't used until very recently, and I think this will really help. Hey, I'm Adam with the Productivity Academy, and as mentioned, we're gonna talk about voice typing with the Chromebook and using Google Docs. So make sure that you have Google Docs open, of course, and just as importantly, I have to say this for completeness, you need a microphone, right? You need something that can pick up your voice. But once you have that set up, you can come into tools and come down to voice typing, or you can just use control shift S. Now we're going to click on that and you see this handy little thing pop up and it says click to speak. So let's click on that. And then you're going to get the pop up. If you haven't already authorized it, that docs at Google wants to use your microphone. Of course, you want to allow that. And now it's going to go ahead and start recording in the background. So there's a lot you can do with this. And you can see it's pretty quick and just kind of keeps going and going and going. So I'm going to let it stop and then stop it manually, start a new line. And you can see that you can really speak pretty naturally and it'll just keep going. I find this is a great way to do, you know, either a, a quick brain dump of something. Um, if you need to just get something out of your head, whatever it is, you can go back and then do some formatting. Now, speaking of formatting, there are ways you can do it using Google Voice or rather the voice to text within Google Docs, uh, but it's it, it, a little slower and I'm going to give you an example. I think a video or a short video is worth a thousand words. So here is a sentence. Select line. Bold. Okay, so you can see that's not hard, but I would say if you're doing this and you have a mouse or a decent trackpad, you're probably going to be faster just doing this, uh, clicking, highlighting, using keyboard shortcuts, whatever you need. If you can do it on the flow or while on the fly while you're doing this and it works for you, that's great. Um, there are a ton if you just go to um, Google uh, support and or you just look for um, voice to text commands for Google Docs and I'll include the link down below you'll find that there are a ton, you know, a lot of it is select this, select that, next paragraph, this paragraph, this line, all that sort of stuff. But basically you can do that along with a lot of things like uh, punctuation, so commas, exclamation points, uh, parentheses, whatever that might be. Uh, but again, I think a lot of that is gonna be faster. And the main uh, biggest utility from a productivity standpoint is just going with the voice, getting all of it out, and then you could go back and form it, uh, format it and either use Google Docs to do that um, or potentially use a third party or a plugin um, that does some sort of um, AI simplification or formatting on it. Um, or again, manually, it's not that hard. So hopefully this helps you with voice to text and Google Docs on a Chromebook. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment below and I will get back to you.